What's happening, everybody? Jay Shockblast here, and check it out. We have Team LMG. Don't ask what it stands for, because I ain't telling you, but we know what it is, and that's all that matters. This is my uh, trio of LEGO YouTubers. Uh, I guess I'm part of the trio, so my, uh, my tag team partners, if you will. Uh, I've gone ahead and created our little stable of... Uh, of heroes for the game and uh, I'm going to show you how you can make your own pack attack in Disney Dan and Jay Shock Blast in your own Lego Marvel Super Heroes game. So let's go ahead and check it right on out. So first of all we have me. It is Jay Shock Blast. That's right. So this is my custom character right here looking too dope. Uh, it's pretty easy to make. Uh, you can give me whatever abilities you so please. I basically gave myself all of them. Uh, I gave myself the double Mjolnirs. And uh, we'll go right on in here into appearance. For helmet, we've got ourselves a hood colored red. For face, I went with Thor. Uh, because he's the only character that looks about right with a beard. Now, I don't really have the, the mustache part of the goatee, but... It is what it is, so we'll go with that. So, uh, also gave myself a red cape. So you just use that cape and uh, turn it red. Now the body is very simple. For body, hips, and, hit and legs, all you have to do is choose Wiccan. Uh, that's what I did, I chose Wiccan for all three. And there we have it, and then for arms, for arms, I decided to go with uh, Stingray. Uh, I wanted a little bit of a different color. I didn't want all black. So, get a little bit of white in there. And we're looking pretty good. Pretty good. So, uh, as far as uh, abilities, uh, I gave myself for hold. We do a beam. Hold on. Uh, beam. That's the to be in color. Oh, I don't want green. I want yellow. Yeah. Yellow as me, so we shoot the beams right out of Mjolnir's, the double red Mjolnir's. Do whatever damage type you'd like. Then when you tap it, it goes into the bolts. So there's that. Uh, so I mean, we do boomerang with the Mjolnir's, and when you tap it, we do stealth. No, we do quick teleport. Haha. <laughs> And then uh, we've got flight and we've got super jump. And then like I said, for the passive abilities, basically uh, just about everything. I didn't give myself wall climbing because I find wall climbing to be a little annoying. But uh, that is basically it. That is your custom J Shock Blast character looking too dope. So next up we have, uh, I'll be honest with you, this character probably cooler than mine. This is pack attack. Now I am the muscle of the team. I'm the, the heavy lifter. When somebody needs to get told out, I'm the one that does it. You know, I'm the one that's a little more aggressive. I'm the one that's a little more angry. So I'm the muscle of the group. The group Pack Attack is the brains. That's right. Now in true Pack Attack fashion, for his head, we went with a Moon Knight because we ain't seen his face and we never gonna. That's right, he is a true superhero hiding behind a mask, and I like it that way. So um, I went with a theme of like yellow, blue, and white. I don't really know why. Um, par partially because I didn't want him to just have a mask. Uh, so when I was going through the helmet options, I really love a Tumas helmet. So I gave him a Tumas helmet, and I gave him um, one of the capes. I think I just chose this one and chose yellow. Um, I could have gone with this one, but there's red in it, and I just wanted to keep this theme simple. So I like the, the yellow cape for him. His character looks so sick. Um, I think it's pretty dope. For his body, I went with Electro 2099. Uh, where is Electro 2099? why it doesn't just start you there all right there we go electro 2099 uh one of my favorite like torsos in the game uh and i i thought i really want to make good use of it 
Uh, for arms, I think these are Quake's arms. Um, I wanted him to be somewhat of a shield agent. And I liked that the silver and the blue kind of all tied in nicely together. So uh, I went with yellow hands for gloves. And then for the boots, I wanna, what are they like? Uh, nope, those are hips. Hips, you can really do whatever you want. I don't even remember who I used, but I went with something blue. Uh, oh, Luke Cage. Luke Cage is the hips and the legs. I just thought it was perfect. It all tied together. I mean, look at how dope he looks. Like, this character is awesome. Like, there's no two ways around it. I, I actually think his character might be cooler than mine, and mine's pretty cool. Um, so for weapon, I gave him some claws, made him blue. Um, for abilities, you know, you can do whatever you want if you want to make your own pack attack, but I gave him dig, I gave him tracking, I gave him fix it, I gave him vine cut, deflect, crack lego walls, grapple, and uh, techno access. Because uh, he is the brains of the team, he's the, the master, the, the wizard. Uh, he's like our healer, you know, he's the guy that, uh, he's the man with the plan, he's, he's got uh, a lot of good ideas, very, very tactical, that's how I picture pack attack. Um, so, you know, I gave him fighting, I mean, we gave him a targeted attack, or targeted lunge, uh, over here when he tapped, we gave him stealth, and we didn't really need to give him anything for holding. And then I believe I gave him a hyper jump and we gave him double jump. So uh, he can do lots of those things. Like I said, tactical stealth, very witty, very, very smart. He is the brains of this operation. And next we've got Disney Dan. And Disney Dan, let me tell you, you might also know him as Bricks to Life. Uh, right here He's the mouth of the south well south of me anyway, so uh, he is He's the uh, he's the voice. He's the the guy that's that does all the talking and uh, He's got that kingly Regal stature to him. Uh, I know that he's uh, done some acting and some singing and I don't know I just feel like I've seen him he showed us a picture and I, I He's very kingly, so I went with King Arthur's crown, and uh, he's very, very fully bearded, so I gave him King Arthur's face. I think it's very fitting. I mean, the hair the hair is probably not his, but, uh, you know, he can live the dream here with us. I would, I would have not picked the hair if we could have just picked the crown. I would have probably given him a, a different, different haircut, but um, as far as how I put him together here, uh, I, I was trying to think of something that would go well with the King Arthur look, but wouldn't just be uh, King Arthur. So uh, obviously the helmet is his helmet, and then his face is King Arthur's face. There's uh, one thing I really, really, really wanted to give him, but it wouldn't leave his crown on. I wanted to give him Craven's kind of uh, this piece, but it just wouldn't keep the crown on, so it's, it's unfortunate. I thought that would have just been like perfect, like the absolute, per like you can already see that it's already part of that suit. It just would have been the perfect accent for the piece. Uh, now for the body, I think we used taser face. Yeah, we used taser face. Now, if you really want to, we could use Yondu, but I thought taser faces fit so much better. Uh, so we went with taser face for the body. Uh, for the arms, we have uh, Spider-Man Noir. Now I would have used one of the Black Knights, I believe. Um, but I don't have it unlocked on here yet. So one of the Black Knights has, oh, Black Knights for Percy. Oh, we are making that change. That is actually what I was looking for. Perfect, because it's got the yellow and the black. It fits in perfect, so there we go. And then for hips, we went with uh, a Tuma. Is not a Tuma. It's my awful Arnold Schwarzenegger. And then for legs, we went with Hawkeye. It's got to be tactical. Uh, now, over here for weapons, uh, we gave him the double uh, guns. And everything he does shoots green. 
Oh no. I liked it actually being different colors. We got yellow. And then uh, right weapon. We had red. I like them. <laughs> he he basically put it. Uh, he's shooting um, ketchup and mustard. So I, I thought that was pretty funny. Uh, so I mean, all the passives for passives. I gave him grapple, uh, techno ass, uh, techno access, uh, fix it, super strength, teleport, and tracking. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll give him some rune tracing too. How about that? Um, and then, you know, he shoots the guns. Like I was saying, uh, his beam, his beam attack, uh, is green and it comes from his weapon. So all of his stuff shoots green. So he's got the ketchup gun, the mustard gun, and they shoot the relish. Um, yeah, so... When you tap it, he shoots the bolts. Um, pretty straightforward stuff. When you hold, we got... Oh, for explosive attack, I had to give him uh, this style right here. It goes along with his... Uh, <laughs> had to give him that black bolt. He's the mouth of the team, man. He's the mouth. So I say that with all due of respect. So he does also go stealth. And that is about it. So the first thing that we're going to do with this team is we are going to get out of here. And we are going to go to my favorite place, Nueva York. Uh, and my guy... Now my guy is obviously the best because I'm the best. And that's all there is to it. But, you know, if we had to expand on that, we can expand on it by saying that my guy is the fastest. Uh, which is why we're going to run everywhere we want to go. Uh, here's pack attack. If I could have picked the colors a little bit better, the yellow or the blue would have been green. Uh, but that was not an option, so. Try no. There we go. So. There is the crew, and that's what they do. Uh, so, let's see if we can find somebody to fight. Concussion. Hit his head. No! That could have been bad. Right into the fire. Oh. I don't know if there's anybody to fight over here. Oh wait, I think there's some that are down by the down by the water a little bit. I wanna see how he fights. I I I'm jealous of like I created this character. I created it for him. And I think it's the coolest one in the group. So I'm jealous of myself for giving him that awesome costume. This is not working out the way I would hope it would, but fortunately we can super jump our way to where we want to be. Can die, rages once more. Can please calm him. <sighs> Alright. There's usually some people to fight over here. There they are. Help! Help! Alright, let's see what he does. I know it's wrong. No! They took my kill. Making Chronopolis <laughs> a safer place one sleep. Ah, oh, look at how awesome he is. I do. You're gonna see Pack Attack start using this character in its own game. It emits a sense of because he knows this, this character is dope. Yeah. Uh who decided to put our and then Dan's gonna make this character. I feel like whenever he shoots, he should just say, Dilly dilly! Dilly dilly! Dilly dilly! Ah. So, I think he. Oh no, he does not do the. <laughs> His ketchup and mustard gun that shoots the relish. So, there you go, there's Dan. 
And then there's me. The place was shot to bits. Stomp. And I am dope. That's Jewel. Then ripped up. Rocket. <laughs> Those golden helmets are so fancy. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of funny the way that that does that. And of course I fly. I want to fly away. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I want to get away. I want to fly. Looks like some trouble is brewing for away. you. You're like a magnet for this stuff, huh? I am a magnet for this stuff. Now, where are they? I feel like she lies. She lies to me to get my, my hopes up. That there's gonna be a fight. Oh, they're over here. That's right. Oh man, I love it. I love shooting the... I'm not doing anything though. They're like stuck. <laughs> we got ourselves a real curly wolf here. <laughs> All right, partner. So there you have it. This is Team LMG. If some kind superhero could see their way to saving me right about now, that'd be great. Would it? Y'all just there for decoration? Do something. Oh, really? Well, I don't really respond well to uh, being told what to do. So, uh, here we have Team LMG. That is Pack Tack. Disney Dan, a.k.a. Bricks to Life. And me, Jay Shock Glass. So, that is what you can do if you want to create them yourself. Uh, these are our official characters unless they decide to change theirs up, but they're so cool that there's no reason they would do that. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And we'll see ya. Gonna go buy me a brand new 10 gallon hat. Or maybe a 20 gallon hat. Do they make those?